So two days ago, a water pipe in my apartment got damaged and flooded my whole apartment in less than 20 minutes. Okay, but what does that have to do with artificial intelligence? To be honest, nothing. But because of this accident, I now have a nice picture of my damaged apartment to try out on the new Mini GPT. So I went to their official homepage to upload my picture. The link is in the description. If you click on the demo button, you can try the AI tool out for free. You are most probably asking yourself, why should I care about this tool? Let me show you some examples where Mini GPT is really a cool life hack. In the left and right examples, you can see that it can write advertisements for you and help you with your marketing strategy. In the middle, Mini GPT even codes a whole joke website just from seeing this note on the whiteboard. Generating a whole recipe only by seeing the picture? That might have been a dream a few months ago, but now, in the age of AI, this takes not more than a second. There are endless possibilities for how to use the tool. Just to name some of them, you could easily get the name of a movie by taking a picture. You want it to write a story about a picture or explain a meme? Mini GPT can help you. Or even better, you want to get some information about your favorite Dragon Ball manga? Even in that situation, it can help you out. Enough with all these functions. Let's get back to my picture with the destroyed floor. And also, I want to give this tool a rating from 1 to 10. But before that, a quick reminder to subscribe to this channel so I can reach my goal of 1000 subscribers. Also, feel free to write in the comments. I am happy for every suggestion, every piece of feedback, and more. So how does Mini GPD work? It is really simple. Just upload your picture and you are ready to go. As of today, the servers for these tools are pretty overloaded, so don't be surprised that you need to wait a little bit till you can chat with your picture. To check out if this tool works, well, I asked it what kind of damage happened to the floor and how it could have happened. Mini GPD answered the following, the damage to the floor appears to be caused by water damage. The water has caused the wood to warp and split, creating a gap in the floor. The water damage is likely due to a leak in the plumbing or a natural disaster such as a flood. It also added that the damage is significant and will require repair or replacement of the affected section of the floor. So the only thing that is missing is my rating from 1 to 10 for this tool. I personally really like Mini GPT and besides that, it is totally free. In my opinion, the only thing they have to improve is the processing time. I will give this tool a 9 out of 10. And that's it with my video. See you in the next one.